Okay, so in this tutorial, we're going to have a look at filing and fixing a bug for Ubuntu. Um, the example that we've got here is just a basic type, typo bug. So in other words, it's just been um, a mistake in typing or it's just been a, a spelling mistake on the behalf of whoever wrote the, the string. Now, the particular bug that we're looking at at the moment is in the source package called Motor Manager. Um, and that will come in handy when we're actually filing the bug because we, we already know what um, source package is out of so we won't have to figure out where it's um, where we have to actually file the bug but the bug itself the the string reads blah 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 and then this word here deleting has this extra e that it doesn't need so it's real basic but um, this will help you figure out how to use the tools on launchpad for even bigger stuff like um, creating more documentation or fixing bugs like these or using this knowledge to fix bigger bugs that aren't just taking out a couple of characters. So what we need to do before we um, get the code and fix the bug we need to file the bug so then there's a bit of a report on it that says um, it means any, everyone else can see it and also it prevents duplication of um, effort if the if the bugs there it means that all the information with that bug is all in one separate central place so we open up the bugs um, section of motor manager and then we come over to report a bug now what we need to do now is just a summary so um, we can just write in the summary something like typo located in and we come back to our other tab with our actual string and then down the bottom in this in this case if it's a different bug you might not always need this but if it's a translation bug or a string bug um, you should be able to just copy this over here and then whoever wants to fix it they'll know exactly where in the package that it is otherwise if you say hey there's a bug in this package go and find it it makes it a bit harder to find unless you've got um, an actual file or a path to look over so we can just copy that over, typo located in dot dot policy etc etc and then go to next and then basically all this will do is just check if there's any duplicates but it, there shouldn't be because it's only just a, a basic new bug that um, probably no one has um, encountered yet. Okay so further information um, I'll just say something like while translating into ENAU I found this string and then we just type in the or copy paste the old string or the original string and then just write something like deleting is misspelled um, should be Deleting. So it's real, real basic that kind of stuff. If if it's a, um, this is basically the most basics of buzz, but at the same time it um, it just shows you how all this stuff works. So and also in the um, description you should also just put the located in again just in case. Um, it just makes it a little bit nicer. Um, so then apart from that, um, your summary will just be up the top. That will be what comes up the top of the bug report. Motor Manager, if you don't, because I was already translating it, already knew what package it was out of, whereas if you're filing a bug for something else, you might have to figure out what package you need to file it against. Usually it's pretty easy, so if you find in the Ubuntu Software Center, you should be able to figure out where it is. Um, and then just try and provide as much information as you can. So the only other thing that we have to do for this bug, it's not a secure, security vulnerability, it's just a basic thing. But um, if you want to file any more of these translational string bugs that are probably really easy to fix, you can put in um, a tag called byte size. That means anyone that is new to um, Ubuntu bug fixing and that kind of stuff, they can um, filter out by these this tag byte size and will come up with all these bugs that are relatively easy to fix. So now if we go submit bug report, there should be a report on Launchpad, so it means that it's there, so people can see it. There's a bug in Launchpad, and now the next step after this is to actually go and fix it, but that'll be in the next section. So I'll see you then.